Morning, y'all. Rick Fearless, Fearless, Strokers Dallas, Strokers Ice House, Punch Wally Garage. Good morning. How you doing? If I don't sound too good today, it's because I don't feel too good. S see, and this is the part, you know, I, I don't know if you know it, but I worked for Roach Paint Glidden for 20 years and one month and I never called in sick. Never missed a day of work. I've been here for 28 years. I've never called in sick, never missed a day of work. The way I feel the last few days, and especially today, is a time that most people would call in sick, but I can't, I won't. Excuse me. Now, people might say, oh, you're going to work sick. You're going to get everybody else sick. No, I keep my distance. I'm not going to go right up to somebody and start talking. I'm going to keep my distance. There's things I have to do. I can't lay on the couch and watch TV. I can't sit at home and worry about how I feel. I'm going to try to get a doctor's appointment for today. Work through it, man. Work through it. Just have some sense. If you're sick, don't be breathing on nobody. I ain't even kissed my pretty wife in two days. About to drive me crazy. Today is Friday, December... Nope. Nope. Yeah. 15th. 2023 year of our Lord. In my life, the 365 Project, the Mr. Peabody Wayback Machine goes back two weeks. So two weeks ago, I was coming to work. It's quarter till two. So we have some homeless people you know, around the area because we're only a few miles from downtown. So we have some homeless people. Excuse me. <coughs> we have some homeless people. There's a little encampment. So I was coming to work and I saw a homeless person in the right lane. I was in the left lane. He was in the right lane going the, uh, the wrong direction with a... a cart, you know, grocery cart that they steal from the grocery store. He is pushing it down the road. He had a piece of rope behind him pulling another shopping cart full of stuff down the road and a piece of rope behind that pulling a couch. So I said, am I seeing this right? And I slowed down. He's pushing a loaded shopping cart, pulling another loaded shopping cart, pulling a couch as the caboose. I figure it's moving day at the encampment. So yesterday when I was coming back from lunch, I looked over there at that little encampment and I saw that big brown leather couch sitting out there. Let's check the chuck. Check that chuck, you. Ooh, hey, look at that. Some more plaid. Yeah, I dug these out yesterday. So these are some various shades of gray. Isn't there some show, some uh, nasty show called Fifty Shades of Gray or something? These are different shades of gray. What is the name of that show? I don't remember. Something about gray. These are some grays. I don't know and I don't care. These are some grays. Black and white logo. Two vent hose. White toe. White sole. Double black racing strap. Black shoe strings. One eye down. Double knotted for safety. I like these shoes. These truly are. Say it with me now. Some handsome chucks. These are some handsome shoes there. Oh, flip it. Flip it. Uh, let's 
see. Dad joke. You know, usually when I lose the TV remote, I usually always find it in some remote location. Slang, the skinny. What's a skinny? Did you go to the doctor today? Yeah, what's a skinny? Means the information, what's going on, what's happening, what's a skinny? Uh, that reminds me of something I thought of yesterday. Okay, I'll write that down before my little brain forgets it. What time am I in? 5.50. Okay. 5.50 means 5 minutes and 53 seconds into this thing. It's 2.46 a.m. <coughs> Excuse me, Scooter. What's today? So it's Friday. Friday, I give a tour at 4.30. So if you want to come in and get a, a, a behind-the-scenes tour... I will personally give it, unless I'm dead, at 4.30 today. If I'm dead, Biggin will give the tour. Uh, I posted a picture and a video yesterday from Greg Elliott. He's a loyal listener and a big supporter of ours. And he had, he owns a company here in Dallas, and he has a an office in China. So he came in and bought a bunch of tie-dye shirts, and then he, he sent me a video of him and maybe 12 or 15 Chinese people all wearing tie-dye shirts. It was wonderful. So I posted a picture of that on the uh, Rick Fairless uh, fan page, face, Facebook fan page. And I'll post it in some other places, but it's pretty cute. Thank you, Greg. Uh, get off the couch and motivational minute. Don't watch the clock. Do like the clock does. Keep moving, slow and steady. Well, I can tell you today I'm moving slower than normal. But I'm gonna keep moving. I may be loaded up with uh, cough syrup and stuff. So last night I was looking for some cough medicine or NyQuil or something. We found three bottles of NyQuil and one bottle of Robitussin. And my wife said, look under the cabinet. She said, let's see if we can find one that's the least amount expired. One of them expired in 2020. One expired in 2021. One expired in 2022. And one was still good. It didn't expire till 2024. So I took that one. My wife was going to throw the other three bottles away. And I said, let's save that 2022 bottle. That's the cough medicine. Just in case. It's only expired for a year. It's probably still good. I think they put the expiration dates on there to, to sell more product, don't you? New Year's Day, we have a chili cook-off. It's always a, a great day. You make the chili at home. You bring it up here. Uh, if you don't want to cook some chili, come on out. It's a, it's a great time. Free shipping, Strokers Dallas Merch, M-E-R-C-H dot com. Free shipping. <coughs> Scooter. Free shipping over $50. 10% off. 10 off. No space. I'd like you to do some Christmas shopping with me, with the Fairless family. We would appreciate that. The White Elephant Christmas Party is tonight uh, here at Stroker's Ice House. And I'm going to leave you with this. You know, the, the movie American Graffiti, which is probably the greatest movie ever, the producer, George Lucas, when he was in high school, he used to listen to Wolfman Jack. So that's why Wolfman Jack was in the, the movie and he played himself because that's what uh, George Lucas used to listen to him growing up. If you've never seen the movie American Graffiti, you've got to see it. Even if you've seen it, you know how great it is. All right, Rick, fearless, fearless. Moving pretty slow, but I'm moving. That's the skinny. Love you, bye.